everyone, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play series. This is Diamond Lumberjack, and today we are going exploring. We need to find a desert so I can start getting TNT together so we can expand our cave. Um, so I'm thinking we're going to get on the old boat here and go past our spawner and just see what lies out there. That would be great if there was a desert out <laughs> right past uh, where we've been looking. Because I need a lot of sand. I need a lot of sand for TNT and glass. So I need to make a lot of glass for our spawner as well. Let's see what our we are at 242 162 so 242 162 will get us back so all right so here we go i've been meaning to go out into the ocean more but haven't really <laughs> been looking kind of cool if we found a village as well or a uh, or them water temple things I've never been in one of them either so that'd be kind of cool there's like nothing out here <laughs> Okay, maybe water wasn't the best way to find a desert. Huh? Well, we found something. It's not a desert, but it's something. I hope this isn't just like a little... Oh, wait, maybe we're here. Nope. <laughs> hmm. Well, we'll just dock here and see where we end up. All right. So I haven't really found a plains biome either, so this is nice. Oh, a nice little ravine in it too. I've noticed a lot, uh, a lot of deserts are connected to plains, so that'd be nice if we could run into one. Over here, I see some sand over there in the distance. Let's go check that out. Um, maybe I should take my boat over there. I'm gonna go grab my boat. We'll head over to this uh, sandy island over here and see what that is. All right, so we are here at that pile of sand. And there is a cave. <laughs> um, looks like this is. What do they call this? A beach. So it's just a really big beach. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and clear this out so that we can get some sand. There should be quite a bit here. And it's far enough away from our main area so it doesn't ruin any of what we could build on in the future so, I'm gonna get this all cleared out and I will see you here in a little bit How did you get up here? I don't know where this guy came from. <laughs> I also got this bow. I was fishing. Infinity and breaking two power to flame. So, really happy with that bow. <laughs> 
Especially uh, Infinity. Seems like a hard Chapman to get. So, I don't know if I could just get Mending on it, man. That'd be great. So, um, we're just about done here. Um, just want to get the rest of this smoothed out. And then we'll head back to our base and possibly start expanding it. Because we'll stop by the spawner on the way back and pick up some... We have some uh, gunpowder and possibly start, you know, blowing up some tunnels and stuff in our cave. So um, I will stop at the spawner so you can see what we've gotten for drops so far. I'm really liking that spawner. It's really efficient and we've gotten quite a bit of drops out of it. So. So I'm going to head back to the spawner and I will see you there. Hello everyone and welcome back. We are here at our spawner. And we have gunpowder. <laughs> lovely, lovely gunpowder. And stacks of it. So we'll be able to make a stack of 64. For TNT, which will go well, a little ways in our cave expansion project. Um, oh wait, no, I need one more stack, don't I? Yeah, I need one more stack. Shoot. Oh, we only need 33 more, so... I will go ahead and get me 33 more TN or gunpowder, and then we will make our stack of TNT. Alright everyone, we are back here at our base and we have enough to make a stack of TNT. Ooh. I have actually never made a full stack of TNT. Yay! <laughs> Alright, I'm going to get some glass going because we are going to need a lot for the spawner and for future projects that I have in mind. suppose I should just throw these in somewhere, but I really need to get a storage room going too. All right, so we need a flint and steel. Do I? Yes, I do. All right. So what I'm thinking of for expanding our cave here is uh, I'm thinking either down this way or maybe we could start down here that would give us a reason to come down this other entrance way or <clears throat> going this way and starting to go down I like that idea too because then we have this like central just everything going different ways area but that could also get kind of messy I think but we'll just see what happens all right um, go in further kind of go down too so let's see what this does I love TNT. It's so much fun. It makes mining a whole lot faster. Ah, oh, sweet. A ravine. Oh, this is the ravine we already found. Cool. This is awesome. All right. So we're going to go down to the ravine. That will give us a lot more uh, building room. Oh, 
<laughs> TNT is also very dangerous. And I'd like to do a one of those info things. Kids, do not do this at home. It is not safe. All right. Um, so we don't have to go down much further, actually. Uh, we'll just keep going down till we hit the bottom of the ravine, I guess. That works out, too, because it saves us some TNT as well. Ah. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. <laughs> All right. It's too bad you couldn't be uh, holding a silk touch pick when you do this, and it would like save all of um, the blocks and stone blocks instead of cobblestone. That'd be really cool. Just gonna blow some more up over here. See what we get out of this. All right, run. I like it I like it a lot so we need a place to make our uh, wheat farm and this will give us more room for that we also need more room to make our cow farm our underground cow farm so this will help with that too um, sheep farm pig farm which is weird because I haven't seen like any pigs around our base area at all so I don't know why <laughs> all right cool 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 I like this Just making everything a little wider down here too, so so it's not so much the cavern look to it. I like caverns. Actually, one of my main world when I used to play on the Xbox was in a cavern, and that looks it looked really cool. But it's kind of a pain to build in a cavern um, right away. But the cool thing about caverns is usually there's other caves and stuff that connect up at the tops and stuff. So you can have like you know, bridges going across and all that good stuff. So, all right, this is looking really nice. I'm liking this. <coughs> nice cave goes on, or this cavern goes on for quite a while. So that's really good. Yeah, where did we come down? Oh, up there. Put one right here. And by one, I mean two. <laughs> All right, let's see what this looks like from the top. I just hope we're not too close to our um, other system of caves or steps. Oh, wow. Yeah, we're pretty close, but I think we'll be able to make it work. And I like to make things multi layered like, you know, levels and stuff like that. So I'm thinking we're going to come across here. Let's go over here. Blast out this wall because we can make a nice little bridge across. Yeah, we'll go across this way. 
Because we have nothing building on this side yet, so. Oof. All right, so we're going to light this and put that. Oh, man. Oh, yes. <laughs> Go a little bit further, and I think we'll be done with TNT for a little while. <laughs> uh, all right, we'll go a bit further this way. Perfect. All right. Run, run. Yes, all right, looks good. So we have more area to build in now, so that's good. <laughs> Man-made area. I was hoping we'd find some more cave systems connected onto these, but no such luck. That's okay though. All right. We got a lot of cleaning up to do over here, but that's okay. Just connect this so we can walk across. There we go. All right, I like it. This will be nice. So I'm thinking in the next episode we'll work on, well, I'll probably clean up a lot of this off camera. Um, start getting paths down here and stuff, but um, we might start building our uh, wheat farm or uh, cow farm in the next episode. So I just really wanted to play with TNT a little bit today. <laughs> so yeah, that worked out real nice. I like that. It's going to be cool over there as well. Hmm. I'm so excited. <laughs> it's too bad I have to get off um, or stop recording here in a very short bit because I got stuff I got to get done today. So. <clears throat> but yeah. Oh, we need to finish that slime farm too. I keep forgetting about that. Uh, we got plenty of sugar cane now. I need to get grass down in here. There's so many things we need to get done. <laughs> uh, at least our cave is starting to expand. And we've got our um, spawner now. So just making strides to our next projects. Also, this stuff here. Um... We got to finish that spawner, enclosing it, uh, putting a storage area on it. We also got to put um, uh, da, 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 what else we got on that enchantment room. I don't know if I said that already. Uh, enchantment room will be very efficient up there. So I'm looking forward to that. How many do I have? Eleven. This will give us quite a bit of stained glass to start with. I love black stained glass. I think it looks awesome. So, but I do want to do more colors as well in the future. So, what did I do? So, all right. Well, I think I'm going to get going here. I have bunch of stuff to get done today and hopefully I can get this uploaded either tonight or tomorrow we'll see how things go um, so I guess this is goodbye for now <laughs> uh, thank you for watching um, I'll see you in the next episode
where we have a lot of work to get done. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.